Okay, welcome back to another edition of the Fireside Brew Review. Today, we're traveling back to Sandwich Brewing Company, and we're gonna be trying this, the White Bronco Juicy IPA. We're gonna be putting some pulled pork and some mac and cheese over the fire, putting that in a wrap. We're gonna be tasting this delicious beer. Let's get started. It's the Fireside Brew Review. What? The Fireside Brew Review. Good talk. What about the Sarah? Ah, uh, great. Obviously. Okay, let's put the grill grate on. Get our pan warmed up. Let's throw some leftover pulled pork in there. Add some leftover mac and cheese. First taste, right in the pan. There we are. Let's put this in a wrap. This is going to be good. All right, we got our food ready here. Got this great beer to try. But I got to show you one thing. I got this great gift from my brother Jeff and his wife Candace, a personalized cutting board that I could do these videos with, and I thank you both for that. I think it just looks fantastic. Before we bite into this wrap, we gotta taste this beer. So this is the White Bronco. It's a strong beer, 5.7%. See, it's got that cloudiness to it. I could smell that citrus rave it off the top here. All right, let's give it a taste. That citrus note hits you right up front. It's a strong hoppy beer. But the balance between the citrus and the hops, it just blends really smooth. To get that much hop flavor and then to balance it with that citrus to make it nice and smooth, that, what a wonderful drink that is. I do like a good hop flavored beer. And with that citrus note, wow. It's probably around a medium flavor. It's just nice and smooth, easy to drink. Well, that's good stuff. And we gotta try this wrap. Look at that. Now this is leftover pulled pork from my barbecue cook. And my lovely wife made this mac and cheese. Together, should make an excellent wrap. Wow, that's good stuff. Wow, that just tastes like barbecue all over again. We'll wash this down with some of this delicious beer. Well, what a great day to be in the backyard enjoying such a delicious beer.
Now it's the part everybody knows and loves, the Sophie scale. But if you don't know what the Sophie scale is, watch this. Take a drink and then you think, pick a color, any color, that's the Sophie scale. Okay, got that? Turquoise blue. I'm gonna sit back and finish eating this pulled pork and mac and cheese wrap. I'm also gonna finish this delicious beer. I encourage every one of you, get to your local craft brewery, find some great flavors like this, bring it home, get in your backyard, find your place, and we'll see you next time on the next brew review.